India will celebrate its 73rd Republic Day on the 26th of January. The South Asian country has invited Egypt's President Abdul Fattah al-Sisi as the chief guest for the Republic Day celebrations. Our principal diplomatic correspondent Sidhan Sibyl spoke with Egypt's ambassador to India, Wail Hamid, on whether Egypt is interested in India's Tejas fighter plane. They talked about food security and how India and Egypt can become strategic partners. Is Egypt interested in India's Tejas uh, uh, fighter jet? I think this is something that I will leave up to the minister to, to, to discuss, for the Air Force to discuss and to see what they can do about that. But definitely we are keep, keeping a very close eye on the advancement that, that India is achieving in its defense uh, industries, especially when it comes to fighter planes, when it comes to, uh, to uh, uh, missiles, when it comes to uh, AEDs. There are many things in, in which India has, has proven to be a very successful country. Mm -hmm. Agriculture has been another key pillar of this relationship. Last year, Egypt allowed wheat from India for the first time. Uh, how do you see this kind of cooperation going forward in terms of the agriculture aspect of the two countries? I, I would like to put this in a broader context, and that is the, the, the context of food security in general. Because food security is not only about wheat. Of course, wheat is very important for Egypt, and as you rightly uh, said, uh, Egypt has approved uh, India as an exporter of wheat uh, to Egypt, unfortunately because of the, 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 the climate uh, change issue and uh, the, tr the drought and uh, the heat wave that uh, hit India this year. India had to ban uh, the export of wheat. This is something that we completely understand, but we hope that this ban is going to be uh, lifted soon so that we can resume our trade relations with India in when it comes to wheat. But also, on the other hand, uh, we, we know that India is uh, in need for uh, fertilizers to guarantee its supply of fertilizers. Egypt is one of the main producers of fertilizers in the region, and there are enormous potentials in this. So the idea of mutual benefit when it comes to food security in general is absolutely there also in terms of market uh, access because there are so many agricultural exports that India can export to Egypt as well as Egypt can export to India. So market access is going to be very important as part of the in general the, the general context of food security. Mm -hmm. uh, so just one clarification, you mentioned about the strategic relationship. So will there be elevation in the relationship, both countries announcing that they are strategic partners? This is something that we're going, uh, that, that I hope we're going to announce during this visit and we will let the details to be worked out at a later stage.